The Nedbank Desert Dash has also become much more than a sporting event, as its benefits go far beyond the sport of cycling. The, role, the race holds great economic value and benefits for local businesses, both in Vintuk, but also in the Ronga region. A contribution which we conservatively estimate at 25 million Namibian dollars. And throughout the preparations of the dash, as well as during the race and the day after, the spending by hundreds of cyclists, the support teams, their families, and cycling fans is a much needed source of income to many Namibian-owned businesses, and many of them SMEs. More than a cycling event, the Netbank Desert Dash represents the spirit of Namibia, the land of the brave. Invited guests, it seems like yesterday when we hosted the Netbank Desert Dash in 2021, and I think all will remember how we battled to overcome the challenges of organizing such a mass sporting event during a pandemic. And by divine grace today, we are once again launching this epic event without any restrictions or measures to be concerned about. And I think that's something truly to be grateful for and to celebrate today. Being able to not only participate, but also have the privilege of hosting such prestigious world-class cycling events has no doubt prepared our cyclists for the international stage. And has also contributed to the likes of top Namibian cyclists such as Tristan de Lange, Alex Miller, and Vera Luza being able to perform and excel at world cycling stage, uh, on the world cycling stage, such as, such as the Olympic Games last year, and most recently at the Commonwealth Games. The Netbank Desert Dash also attracts both local and international cyclists. But last year we saw cyclists from South Africa, Malawi, the United States, Germany, Portugal, Britain, France, Serbia, Canada, Ireland, Belgium, and Botswana. And this year, the entries have indicated we will once again have cyclists from all over the world ride in the Netbank Desert Dash 2022. This in itself is a much welcome contribution to the Namibian tourism, an industry which has been severely impacted by the effects of the COVID pandemic.